Did you know that Nestle, one of the world's largest food and beverage companies, was initially established to solve a simple problem? Infant mortality? Yes, you heard it right. The tale of Nestle begins with a man named Henry Nestle, a Swiss pharmacist who was deeply concerned about the high infant mortality rates in the mid-19th century. He firmly believed that proper nutrition was the key to saving these young lives. In 1867, Henry Nestle created a breakthrough infant food, a cereal that was both digestible and nutritious. This wasn't just any ordinary cereal, it was a potent mix of cow's milk, wheat flour, and sugar. This innovative concoction was designed to combat malnutrition and provide infants with the essential nutrients they needed to survive and thrive. Henry Nestle's cereal was a game changer, offering a lifeline to countless infants and revolutionizing infant nutrition. But the story doesn't end there. As the popularity of Nestle's infant cereal grew, so did the company. In 1905, Nestle embarked on a significant merger with the Anglo-Swiss Milk Company, a leading manufacturer of condensed milk. This merger marked a pivotal moment in Nestle's history, expanding its product range beyond infant cereal and propelling the company into new markets. The union of these two giants created a powerhouse in the food and beverage industry, setting the stage for Nestle's global dominance. This journey from a small-scale operation focused on solving a pressing societal issue to becoming a global titan in the food and beverage industry is a testament to Nestle's innovative spirit. It's a story of how one man's concern for infant health morphed into a company that touches millions of lives every day with its vast array of products. And thus, Nestle as we know it today was born out of empathy and innovation. From its humble beginnings, Nestle has grown into a brand synonymous with quality, trust, and a commitment to improving lives through nutrition. But as we'll see in the next scenes, this journey hasn't been without its hurdles and controversies. Stay tuned as we continue to unravel the fascinating history of Nestle, Nestle's expansion and innovations. From its humble beginnings, Nestle started to spread its wings globally. An entrepreneurial spirit, coupled with an unwavering commitment to quality, propelled the company to new heights. Nestle's journey of global expansion was not a simple one, but one marked by strategic acquisitions and diversification. The company's first major leap was its merger with the Anglo-Swiss Milk Company in the early 20th century. This union not only expanded Nestle's product range, but also helped it mark its footprint in new territories. The company didn't stop there. It continued to grow, reaching far and wide, making its presence known on every continent. Nestle's story of expansion is also a story of innovation. Each acquisition, each new product, was a step towards meeting changing consumer needs and shaping the global food and beverage landscape. Nestle's commitment to innovation extended beyond product development, influencing every facet of its operations from supply chain management to marketing strategies. The growth of Nestle was not just about expansion, but also about innovation. Over the years, Nestle has shown that it is not just a company that grows, but one that evolves, innovates, and leads. And that's what makes Nestle's journey not just a story of a successful business, but a testament to the power of innovation and the spirit of entrepreneurship. Nestle's Modern Era Entering the 21st century, Nestle continued to grow and adapt to the changing world. Like a chameleon, Nestle has always been adept at adapting to its environment. As the world became more health conscious, Nestle responded by venturing into health science and performance nutrition. It was not just about making food anymore. It was about making food that could improve your health and enhance your performance. Nutrition, health and wellness became the cornerstone of their business strategy. They invested heavily in research and development, aiming to unlock the power of food to enhance the quality of life for everyone, today and for generations to come. Nestle's health science division was born out of this vision. It's not your typical food company division. It's a hybrid between a pharmaceutical company and a food company, blending the best of both worlds to create products that can manage health conditions like obesity, diabetes, and Alzheimer's. It's not just about treating these conditions, but also about preventing them. Meanwhile, Nestle's performance nutrition division is all about fueling your body to reach its full potential.
Whether you're an athlete pushing your body to the limit or a busy professional needing an energy boost, Nestle has a product designed for you. They're not just creating food, they're creating fuel for the body. Nestle's commitment to bettering the world doesn't stop at nutrition. They're deeply committed to sustainability and corporate social responsibility. They understand that their success is tied to the health of our planet. They've pledged to achieve zero net greenhouse gas emissions by 2050. They're reducing their water usage, minimizing waste, and promoting responsible sourcing. They're not just talking the talk, they're walking the walk. In the modern era, Nestle is more than a food and beverage company. It's a health company, a nutrition company, a sustainability champion. They've evolved to meet the changing needs of the world while staying true to their roots. Today, Nestle stands as a testament to continuous evolution and commitment to bettering the world. Criticisms and controversies Despite its global success, Nestle has not been without its share of controversies. Like many corporations, it has had to navigate the choppy waters of public opinion and ethical debates. Today, we delve into some of the most notable controversies that have marked Nestle's history. Firstly, we take a step back into the 70s, a time of disco, flared trousers, and unfortunately, the infamous baby formula scandal. Nestle was accused of aggressively marketing their infant formula in less developed countries without adequate warnings about potential health risks when not properly used. The fallout was significant, leading to a global boycott that lasted several years and tarnished Nestle's reputation. This incident remains a stark reminder of the importance of ethical marketing practices, especially when it involves vulnerable demographics. Fast forward to the more recent past, we find Nestle in the midst of another controversy, this time concerning the company's water usage. Nestle has faced criticism for its water extraction practices, particularly in areas suffering from drought. Critics argue that such actions contribute to water scarcity and damage local ecosystems. Nestle, on its part, maintains that its practices are sustainable and that it strives to use water responsibly. Yet the debate continues, illustrating the complex balance between business interests and environmental stewardship. In both these instances, Nestle's controversies have not been mere blips on the radar. They've sparked global discussions about corporate responsibility and the impact of business practices on society and the environment. They have led to changes within the company and have influenced how other corporations operate. These controversies remind us that even the most successful companies have their fair share of challenges. It's a testament to the fact that success in business is not just about profits, but also about navigating the complex landscape of ethics, public opinion, and sustainability. It's a lesson that Nestle, like many others, continues to learn and adapt to. Nestle's future. As we look towards the future, what does it hold for Nestle? As we've learned from its rich history, Nestle has always been a company intent on evolving and adapting to the needs of the world. The future appears to be no different. Nestle's focus is shifting towards health and wellness, a sector that has seen exponential growth in recent years. In an era where consumers are becoming more health conscious, Nestle is striving to meet this demand by reformulating its products to contain less sugar, salt, and saturated fats. They're also expanding their portfolio to include more plant-based options and functional foods that cater to specific dietary needs. So in the future, we can expect to see Nestle continuing to innovate and adapt in the health and wellness sector. But it's not just about the products they're offering. Nestle is also taking a hard look at how they operate as a company. They're working towards achieving zero environmental impact in their operations. This means making their packaging recyclable or reusable by 2030, reducing their greenhouse gas emissions to net zero by 2050, and ensuring that 100% of their agricultural raw materials are sustainably sourced. These are ambitious goals, but they show Nestle's commitment to being part of the solution to the environmental challenges we face. There's also a focus on digital transformation. Nestle is investing in technology to enhance its operations and customer experiences from using artificial intelligence for personalized nutrition to employing blockchain for supply chain transparency. This digital shift will undoubtedly shape the company's future, making it more efficient, transparent, and customer-centric. In conclusion, the future of Nestle seems to be one of innovation, 
responsibility, and continuous growth. They're not just looking to create products that consumers love, but also to operate in a way that respects our planet and its resources. As we move forward, we can expect to see Nestle continue to evolve and adapt, taking on the challenges of the future with the same resilience and innovation that has characterized its past. The future of Nestle seems to be one of innovation, responsibility, and continuous growth.